Hey guys, I've got a tutorial for you today. As you can see by the title, I'm going to be showing you how to mod the Field Runners game. Alright, let's get right into this because it's kind of long. Okay, go ahead and open up Cydia. Uh, you are going to go into Cydia. You are going to add the source sinful iPhone repo. I'll show you that here. Um, you can check my channel for the video. I have a video on the whole thing. For, um, but I'll just show you it anyways, right here. Go to Manage, go to Sources, go to Edit at the top right, and then go to Add. Then you're going to add this, the Sinful iPhone repo. Right there. And it's HTTP colon slash slash, oh shoot, come on. HTTP colon slash slash Sinful, S-I-N-F-U-L, iPhone, I-P-H-O-N-E, repo, R-E-P-O dot com forward slash. Go ahead and add that source. It's going to ask you if you want to add it because it's unsecure. Just go ahead and click yes. Provides you with all the correct info that we're going to need. Alright. Let's continue on. Okay, next you're going to search iFile. Okay. This application will allow you to recreate the file system in the game. iFile. Search. Alright. As you can see, I searched it, and then there's the regular one. It's four dollars. Then we have iFile cracked, and I already have it installed because of the green arrow. Just go ahead and click on it, install it, and then just close Cydia. All right. Now go to your last page, or wherever the next open slot is. Go and look. Sorry about that. Jeez. Alright, just look at the iFile icon right there. It's like a finder type thing. Go ahead and click on it. And this should um, open up your whole file system here. Under. See, I already have the Field Learners app open, but hold on. It should take you to like this right here. It should take you to mobile right off the bat or if it's in VAR just if it's in VAR go to mobile hold on let me close my door it's freaking fun just go ahead and if it's um, at VAR go to mobile then go into applications and you're gonna hit you're gonna go up and you're gonna search and you're gonna go to hierarchy or hierarchy whatever it is you're gonna search field just search field and it should come up Should come up here in a minute. It's loading. Come on. All right, there it is. Go ahead and click on the folder fieldnerners.app. Go into it, and as you can see, here's all the scripts. If we go down, there's a ton of it. There's just, it's not even funny how much there is. But I'm gonna show you the one that I edited. Uh, let me see if I can find it. Uh, um, let's see. I'm gonna see if I can find it. I forget where it is. It's a tower. But you're gonna scroll all the way down to T towers, because those are the towers that you wanna edit to make them better. All right. And you can like mod the screen and everything in the game, but I'm just showing you. Wait, what was I doing again? Tower. Oh yeah. Alright, almost there. Okay, tower. Okay, you got the tower flame, tower, tower flame dot tower. That's what we're looking for. But I'll show you the one I edited. Tower Gatling. Does the that's the little like automatic tower type thing. Uh, lightning tower, 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 tower lightning. All right. Tower lightning, tower underscore lightning dot tower. And you always want to choose the dot tower ones. Mine is 636 megabytes. I believe that it's more or less right there for you guys already because I've already edited it. It's going to give you options to open with. Just choose text viewer. Wait a second. Alright, and it's going to give you a script. 
kind of small, so I can't really show you. But um, it's going to say like level whatever, like level 11, level 12, and level 13 there, kind of. You can see, but I don't think you can. Then it goes minimum damage, max damage, field of view, reload speed, attack radius, cost, projectile, and then level 12, level 13, okay, and so on. I pretty much edited level 1 so I don't have to upgrade them all. So I did the minimum damage to 3,000, the max damage to 4,000. Now let's look at level 12. Minimum damage 1,000, max damage 1,100. So right off the bat you can see I already edited it. The field of view is the same. Um, the reload speed, let's check that. I set it to 0 0.3 which is 3 tenths of a second. <laughs> And the reload speed for the level 2 is 1 second. <laughs> so there's a difference, so it's almost automatic. I did the attack radius for the first level 100, and the attack radius for the second and third up upgrade one is 90. So right off the bat, you can see that too. So pretty much, you can just go in, and you just hit that edit little up here, and then it brings up the keyboard and you select where you want to edit and what you want to edit and you can just edit it but I'm just gonna save because I already like how it is now I'm gonna show you an example so go ahead and close that out and most of you guys if you haven't played field owners already know that the lightning tower costs 70 coins but I modded the cost of it to be zero <laughs> so you don't even have to pay for it um, so here we go you should play. Oh, and before you do this, you might want to like um, SSH and save the file, the original file of the game, just so you don't screw it up and you can put it on later. So I'm going to choose this map because I already did the first one. <laughs> Alright, just do medium classic. I don't care. It's loading. We'll wait for it here. And I'm going to try and zoom in for you. See if I can get it to zoom in. And the first time I played it didn't screw up, so... Alright, here it goes. Alright, so as you can see here at the bottom right, Lightning Tower is zero dollars, if you can see that. I don't think you can see that, but it's zero dollars, and it says I'm already available to choose it, so right off the bat you know I can choose it. And I only have like 10 bucks or whatever up there. 15. So right off the bat you can tell. So I'm going to just touch it. Put a lightning tower right here. Put a lightning tower over here. Put a lightning tower over here. Put a lightning tower here. So already you can see that I've already uh, done it right. So see it's already zapping them. And I got one over here. And it's just, yeah really good and that's how you mod a game um if you guys want to see more mods for more games i would be happy to show you guys them remember to rate comment and subscribe for more modding videos tutorials and unboxings thank you for watching this video this was blondie 1996 peace out you guys